In Masters of Social Work programs across the country, students struggle to make ends meet, often living paycheck to paycheck while working hundreds of unpaid hours as part of their program requirements. The idea that students be required to work with no form of compensation to receive their degree is detrimental to the well-being of social work graduate students. Many struggle with the high cost of living and have difficulty balancing classes, field placements, and outside jobs they take to survive. How can we best serve our clients when we ourselves are under such immense financial and emotional stress? As a result of unpaid field placements, I have witnessed my colleagues take on undue stress trying to maintain their mental well-being while balancing university requirements and maintaining an outside job to meet their basic needs. I do 20 hours of field work a week, I commute to campus, I'm in three classes, and I have two outside jobs in order to pay my bills. One is a graduate student researcher and one is a waiter. To me, having a livable stipend would quite literally change my life. It would mean no more watching the sunrise on the 405 after working a closing shift. No more trying to keep my focus on my clients knowing that I have to run out to work in half an hour. No more four hour nights of sleep or skipping meals. No more squeezing my assignments in at midnight after working from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. I've succeeded at the, in this program at a detriment to my own physical and mental well being. I'm here because I'm passionate about social welfare and making a difference in my community. I just wish our university shared the same passion. Receiving a livable stipend in my MSW program would be life changing. It would make me believe that my labor as a social worker is actually valued. It would make our program accessible to people who want to be doing this work but who can't afford to be spending years, thousands of hours of unpaid labor. And it would allow me to really give my all and, and be my full self in placement and in classes. Paying social work interns legitimizes the care and labor that we provide to our placements and allows us to show up more fully in our work, education, and personal lives without worrying about housing, food, covering our basic needs, and also covering the fun that we deserve to have. Payments for placements calls for universities to provide stipends to social work graduate students who do not already receive stipends from their field placements. The University of Michigan students founded the first Payments for Placements chapter and many other MSW students have started chapters at their own schools. The University of Michigan chapter pushed their school to create an alumni donation fund that will provide stipends for students demonstrating greatest financial need and joined the National Association of Social Workers Michigan chapter in successfully advocating for a state-funded paid apprenticeship program for school mental health workers. The University of Texas Austin chapter successfully pushed their administration to create a limited number of stipends for students demonstrating greatest financial need and to reduce their required MSW field hours from 1,080 to 900. The Arcadia University chapter won full paid field work. Its students will be paid stipends funded through their university's unrestricted endowment. Although their program is small, this is a huge accomplishment and proof that funding through university endowments is possible. Like University of Michigan, UCLA provides stipends to law school students who take internships at nonprofit organizations. So why can they not offer MSW students the same? We want to create a UCLA Payments for Placements chapter to create a framework through which students can push UCLA for change as a collective.